Okay, uh, everyone is here. Few missing, doesn't matter. Hello, everyone. Is my voice clear? Everyone is hearing hearing me, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, and others. We will uh, we will do in uh, we will wrap it wrap it up in thirty minutes eventually. So there will be few question and answering and also i'm going to show you my yesterday trade how i trade i do trade only uh us session london session i was not in the market i was uh, busy with my family and few guests that's it let me know when you see my screen shakir you here You guys see my screen? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Okay. Let's start from here. So let's go to the daily first. On daily, we have this, and this is our eventually the direction which is giving us that we are going to the buy and this buy confirmation is eventually from here when we saw this candle this candle this candle is giving us the vibe that we are going to the upper side that's the reason i was keep telling uh whatever you take on sell side it is the retracement whatever is the buying side you are trying it is the main direction so this is the fuel of our buy, buy direction so this is the main fuel again we are seeing because an engulfing we are seeing on here also it is a level on here this is the level breakout level or it is a breakout level on here so one candle it did not it did touch and it is not fresh so the fresh one eventually started high here and we see this this candle and eventually buying and we have another engulfing on here so this is the confirmation for us to going to the upper side that's the reason that i was keep telling whatever reaction reaction you are seeing on the buy side we are going to take it for the longer term and the sale will be shorter term let's go to my trade what i did yesterday so go to the h4 h4 what is showing us that we have so many this is the engulfing sell and eventually this is the failed one so we are confirming this is on the buy so i was not i was not looking for that i was looking for i go to the 30 minute in the 30 minute if you are seeing that we have few things one look at this one this is the level and this is this is tasted on here this tasted on here so this is not fresh so we have a fresh level here this is the fresh one we are expecting when market goes back to that level similar to this one market created a fresh level touch with that one and eventually come back a little bit down and then it created another fresh level touch with that one and we are seeing a rejection and a little bit sell so i saw this one is fresh when i come to the market also i saw this is an engulfing we are seeing on here just give me a minute Ooh. okay so market goes back to this engulfing zone when this engulfing is created anyone want to join or something okay so this is an engulfing and market when i saw this engulfing with a very fresh level i go to the five minute in the five minutes something extraordinary if you look at this one so we know a pattern which is similar to head and shoulder pattern look at this one when you see an high and low market will take out this high also take out this low now our expectation is when market come back to this level we are going to open a sell so this is what happened so market come back to your level and we are expecting a sell 
if you find any engulfing level on this level this is more confluence level as this one is 30 minute is very fresh also we see a five minute engulfing on here and this is the qm pattern look at this pattern and look at this pattern look at low go to the line chart high low higher high lower low market did not come to that level right this is the level where it is come look at this this is the level now go to the candlestick pattern look at this so as i who is in my mentorship or not my mentorship but know how i do trade on engulfing i said when this two level is so near try to put your stop loss above this high like this high is so near like this way give me a time so if you this high is so near to this one you put your stop loss above this high but if it is a little bit higher try to put it stop loss here, this high so you can minimize your risk or by that way so what you are seeing here high low higher high this high with a very few pips upper side on this one so when market come back to here i open a sale on here exactly on here first one and i put my stop loss on on this high a little bit higher so this is almost like 12 to 13 pips stop loss my calculation is if i find any trade which is less than 25 pips stop loss i try to take is 50 pips if it is 25 pips then i'm going for one is to two that is also 50 pips so if the stop loss is five pips 10 pips 15 pips like less than 25 pips i go for 50 pips yet so i i posted this one is on the, on the on the channel so i take a sale on here i see this sharp movement also so i take another one on 97 i think on this gap yes so this is the gap level i take and i exited on uh 50 pips higher this is 58 pips i did not this is the exited on here i took that sell so this is the first one that i took yesterday now go to the second one me and my student leave went for the same went for the same i was shakir invented something i was watching that level shakir was invented it was recently invented something this is the engulfing and if it is matched with some level we open a sale on here so i was testing it but i did not practically imply it on my real chart yet so there is a sale here but i did not expect market will go that much sharp eventually so what happened market when i see this is the shopping movement i saw on let's go to again the 30 minute so what you are seeing this is a fresh level again this level never touch this is the first time it is touching here and we are seeing a very fresh engulfing on here yeah so i immediately went for buy from here this is the buy for me this level i open for buy but i go for the five minute also so i i was looking for any engulfing on here i saw this engulfing this engulfing eventually which is which is related to this low so i open my trade my stop loss was here is maybe uh, 22 pips but leave somehow enter on this engulfing that's why he has keep telling like he had like 11 pips i i follow last when uh market just closed and i was looking for why he take that one only 12 or 11 pips so if you if you count his trade look at the buy he took from here he exited a little bit 100 and something this is this is his is like eight pips market drawdown but he said he was having like 12 pips but for me it was like uh, 22 pips 22 pips i put a little bit down on this bottom and i exited on 100 pips he is also exited on 100 pips that's it the second rate and the last one when i said uh i am i will go i'm going to show you something just have to want it running i have to close it so when 30 minute this candle load like this candle i was looking to break out this candle this is the zone that i said fresh so until it is not failing so i go to the five minute again and i saw this is the candle with very sharp movement which failed here i go i was looking for now sell only as market is so volatile i was looking for a one minute trade right now so i saw this one look at this one this is an engulfing and and look at this what happened 
as it is one minute i was looking for fresh engulfing so one two three this candle confirm as the fresh engulfing on here but the fourth candle eventually go to our zone and i saw when i saw this zone i did not take it because i was waiting for breakout this eventually this whole zone so it was not eventually break out that level so i i waited for here a little bit couple of time i saw an engulfing buy here and i was on now an engulfing sell so i saw this engulfing sell when this candle eventually closed with this candle this is like similar longer time frame analysis i saw market just failed this one and now my time is to wait for this candle when it is coming back to this zone i just it touched that one i had my limit on eventually here this is the limit i had i put my sell limit here and stop loss was little bit upper side on this one as it is a little bit volatile I, it is showing 21 but i had like 27 pips stop loss and i tried to exit on this bottom this bottom so this is 115 pips i take these are the three trades that i had yesterday with um, uh, only only uh, london say new york session where is 100 pips this and another one is eventually uh why is the qm the first one i showed you so this is the this is the three trade i had like 50 pips 100 pips and 100 pips 200 pips and that that's how we uh come to an end of ten dollar to almost six thousand dollar that's the trade so now we are going to do the question and answering if you guys any if you guys have any question or something let's go with the question and answering any question of the trade that i took or the problem you are facing or or whatever with the chart only let's start you guys hearing me right okay so i i now i'm expecting some question eventually so as as i'll do a little bit few question and answering question guys why we're here we're here for question and answering like what types of struggle you're having what types of problem you're facing why execution taking some times and whenever you execute why you are making the losses that's kind of question i'm expecting question. yes that's the reason we are doing the session today yeah. Yeah, uh, i'm struggling uh, i have my zone everything is perfect but then uh, entry i am studying with entry bro uh okay what uh, what lower you time can, lower time confirmation time. Uh, what kind of analysis you are following bro investing and msnr okay great so okay any other question so that i can I adjust with this question anyone else any have any other question Okay, same uh, MTF problem. Fine. Any other? Any other one? We are we are eventually covering everything. When I know, yeah, I understand that MTF. Bikram, uh, you have so many question on the group. Do you have any question for me now? Okay. No, no worry. Ah, uh, how to convert? Yeah basically most of the question based on the multi time frame any other question okay so um let's go to the chart for me uh let's go to the weekly uh, sorry monthly first Why is the chart okay monthly let's start with the monthly so this is an engulfing first one in the monthly which is telling us that we are looking for buy when you see this engulfing failed 
with this candle this is also mostly showing us that we are going for buy is that so no please can you repeat your voice back sorry okay no problem uh this is the first monthly bullish engulfing we are seeing here right so also at this at the same time this is a sale engulfing we are seeing when this engulfing failed with this candle this is the giving us confirmation now one buy bullish engulfing also the failing one so it is giving us confirmation for going for long buy and and we have this engulfing here so we have we have march april two month so let's work with march only forget about april in march this is the zone that where we see that engulfing failed and now we are looking for only buy let's go to the daily in the daily time frame look at this one what we have we have a buy engulfing market never come back to our buy engulfing so all the buy happened here but we have a sideway market here let's work with only this part as this is the you know uh, in the shorter time trade even one minute or monthly this kind of movement is not problem the problem we face in the sideway market so let's go with the sideway market this is the sideway market we are seeing right now let's go to four hour chart in the four hour chart look at this what we have for the better of understanding let's mark this is the sideway zone that we are working right now look at this uh, this is the first buy engulfing we are seeing on here and this is the sell sell engulfing eventually no this sell is eventually we saw this is the first sell engulfing we are seeing here so look at this do we identify our zone buy one and sell one when you identify your buy zone and sell zone and let's say listen this is a sale engulfing and this is a buy engulfing when this sale engulfing created with this candle we have two option option number one either it has to go with our zone or it has to come with this zone is it these are the two option we have right i mark my level but hesitate to enter now we get this guy okay no problem let's stay with me for now we will we'll cover everything uh, in the session so the look at this chart uh, what we are seeing here when market created this engulfing we have two option either market goes back to this level if this it goes back to this level we are looking for sell when it's coming back to this level we are looking for spy in that case in that case look at this what happened it come back to our buy zone now we go to 30 minute in the 30 minute look at this what we need to do in the 30 minute if you are an aggressive tailor sailor sorry aggressive trader you have something which is a engulfing here look at this here and engulfing not here but here this two this is the two zone we are seeing on here look at this so when this is h4 candle created and come back to your zone if you are an aggressive trader you immediately enter on this engulfing this engulfing and the stop loss you just a little bit down to it it is like look make it 20 pips if you are tracking only 20 pips straight first always try to do 50 pips if your sl is more than 25 pips try to do one is to two so the first trade you enter on your zone you take it like as i said 50 pips this is the 50 pips done now again market come back to your zone when it is come back to your zone your job is to look for a trade control what is the trade control trade control is when market come back to your zone you look for any engulfing it created so this is an engulfing it created and and it is went upper side to the main h4 zone look make color it a little bit different this is the h4 zone and this is the 30 minute zone market come back to your 30 minute zone when it is come back to your 30 minute zone go to the five minute just give me a minute i am always struggling to do this kind of thing uh when i 
go to the back data so we are not seeing the back data let's go to the 15 minute okay so let work with only 15 minutes same goes for five, five minute also so as i said when you find your 30 minute zone on here look at this how many engulfing we're seeing on here engulfing number one engulfing number two so what market did when it created this engulfing and come back to that engulfing look for buy here again it is not even 15 pips make it 20 pips and look for what i said whenever you enter less than 25 pips try to 50 pips this is your 50 pips done now this is the h frozen on the sell side look at this market come back to your zone and goes to again your sell side now when you see a sell side as go as yet you look for something which is engulfing again look at this this is your engulfing first one first one market immediately come back to your engulfing let's say you missed it but the next time it is also goes to your engulfing zone and look for sell look at this the stop loss how much this is 25 pips so as still i said 50 pips when you find it 20 if it is like 30 pips look for look for 60 pips so where is the 60 pips this is the 60 pips this is how you go to multi time frame let's see something on 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 on, on new zone let's see something okay so let's work with this only this this zone delete everything we have here look at this this is engulfing sell and this is an engulfing buy when i said when market created an engulfing sell as it is come back immediately to your zone buy zone is it guys you guys you, you guys understanding me right what i'm saying okay okay great like no i know i do not face this kind of situation whenever i do like other session we we go with uh, a conversational way like i talk something i ask something they ask something we answered but this is kind of like i'm talking only myself so <laughs> so looks uh this is the sale engulfing it created and buy engulfing it is immediately come back to your buy engulfing so what i said when it is come back to use zone now go for 30 minutes in the 30 minute look something which is again created any engulfing so this is the zone it created this is the engulfing it created now look at this market immediately come back to your zone engulfing zone right so now you go to the five minute on the five minute look at this in the bottom side how many engulfing you are seeing on here this is the first engulfing and market immediately come back to your engulfing and look at the buy this is the buy if 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 okay okay so this is the buy uh 27 pips 54 pips is used is your target that's one that's it now let's say you missed it right you missed it what are you now going to do you look for any other engulfing on the like like as i said how multi time frame work this is the five minute now this is you look for any engulfing if on one minute here this is the zone same zone same zone look any engulfing you see on on here delight delight do you guys see any engulfing on here this one look at this and that's your buy 20 pips so go for 50 pips that's it why and also this is the roadblock you're seeing on here let's say anything we have on 5 minute 15 minute no we do not have anything we have a gap level here so this is how eventually we do a multi time frame this is the last market what we are having what we are having it's easy if you also look at this this is the one last one engulfing we are seeing and market immediately come back to your engulfing and can give you the reaction so if this zone is little bit big for you as market is volatile it is 56 pips so let's say we are not going to open any trade which is more than 30 pips let's go to the five minute 
any engulfing we are seeing in the five minute no it's still the same zone which is covering our longer longer vision let us go to the 30 minute any engulfing yes now we are seeing something this one now our en engulfing zone is coming a little bit shorter away now it is 40 pips so we do not take also any which is 40 pips let's look for other yes now look at this look at this la life chart example this is the last engulfing one and and i'm going to delete this one go to the five minute look at this how much 17 pips not even 17 pips market only give like i think 8 pips drawdown but it is less than 20 pips this is how you filter so if you enter on anything less than 20 pips for 25 pips first initially try to do with 50 pips uh this is it this is your this is your exit anything anyone Bro, yes, yes. You said trade control. When we look at trade control, it's on 30 minute time frame. If your base time frame is 40 minute, go with the 30 minute. Once you understand how trade control work, you can eventually go to the 15 minute. For me personally, most of the time, 85% trade, I do not look for trade control. But for rules, I use trade control. Once you are not getting any entry, trade control is your friend. Why trade control? Let's say you trade without trade control, your win rate will be 50%. But if you if you take trade with trade control, your win rate will be more than 80 to 85% and your trade will be less. But win rate will be higher. Bro, when you put entry, uh, when you talk about that, but I'm still asking. Uh, you, you know that what, uh, your trade is in your 5 minute confirmation or 15 minute confirmation? No, I filter, I filter, I come from, let's say uh, we know what going to daily, so I do not take anything with the daily time frame. I look for one, uh, like I open the chart today, I look for daily candle, so as last few days daily is only bullish, so there is nothing to think about daily. Let's go to the H4, what H4 is showing us? like how i draw the zone a little bit earlier i draw my zone buy zone sell zone so when i draw my zone i go to the 30 minute time frame to see the zone reaction when market come back to one zone to another zone or retrace to one zone to another zone i go for the 5 15 minute i filter 15 minute engulfing with the five minute and then if i see the stop loss is little bit bigger so i just try to fresh not fresh and everything and i go to the one minute so that you know uh, yesterday was little bit uh, volatile most volatile uh, that's why i mostly look for one minute and and it was working but most of the time i try to stick with the five minute and if i don't see anything with the five minute i go to the one minute Bro, uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, I ask more. yes sure go ahead as no no one is asking uh, in that case in that yeah. case in that case I, I i got your question listen <laughs> i have gone through with this phase i know what you are asking so there will be lots of engulfing zone. Which one you should pick, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> In that case, let's say you are wait for buying zone. Market come to your zone. Whatever zone. No, your your screen is stuck. Okay. No, I am not. My screen is not stuck. I am here eventually to sue any any question you are asking or not. Okay, okay. So let's say I am I am here on yesterday look at this
only one example I'm going to show you the one I took eventually right this is the engulfing zone we are seeing right okay. and we see a reaction from here we see a reaction so yeah, yeah. let's go to the one minute so this one minute reaction eventually happened so fast so fast right so again yeah. come to 30 minutes when you see this reaction happen and if you go to the 15 minute what you are seeing this candle all the level on 30 minute and the 15 minute is also break down with break with this candle this is the breakout zone right also if you follow the you are you are the one who follow the snr yeah yeah so look at this yeah. one forget about the engulfing this is the breakout so in the breakout system what we know b p e what it is breakout pullback and entry right yeah okay so this is the breakout level now my 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 condition is what i go to the one minute time frame so in the one minute time frame when it is breakout now it is showing us the direction uh, that we are going to the downside is it yeah, for that as i said in the breakout system what we need to need see breakout pullback and entry breakout pullback and entry that's the reason that's the that's the paced formula of snr if you combined yeah, snr yeah. with engulfing now see the magic so look at this one this is the breakout right look at this why this yeah. is the breakout in one minute this is the breakout look at this this is the breakout right this is the breakout so what i said breakout means this and we need a pullback for entry right so go to candle so this is the pullback i miss that one this is the pullback i miss that one also with that pullback look at this one engulfing and it is also fulfilled so i waited but when i saw this buy engulfing this buy engulfing look at this one this is the word buy engulfing yeah. okay now look carefully how how you filter your uh trade like if there is many uh mini zone so from longer time frame when market breakout this zone we know market is going to sell is it with this breakout yeah, and yeah. and and we have a sale on here i missed it also with engulfing if you see breakout with this one and 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 again it is breakout and pullback with this engulfing right now yeah. we know market is going to downside based on the breakout of higher time frame look at this we need to see two things one if you are a SNR trader we need to look for the breakout of this candle is it yeah and 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 this is the breakout now it is retested but not failed and again it is breakout with this candle now it is fresh yeah. right so when this engulfing buy happened at the same time when market this engulfing failed also with the snr breakout we see something incredible here which is buy engulfing now out of all this one is also buy engulfing right yeah this one is also this one this one no we have only two buy engulfing this one and that one so which one we should pick that's the question so this is the this is the yeah. this is the failed zone you range if anything is nearer look at this one this one is nearer right and this candle is failed also when market come back to you this engulfing zone look at now this engulfing is you know is in your range a little bit higher and the lower side uh, let me let i'm going to give a little bit more example and we see market immediately goes back to your zone 
and that's the reason also I open the cell on here. So that's how I filter. In a in a in a short terms, if you see, let's say this is an this is a uh, what it is sideways market, right? This is a sideways yeah. market. So if you are looking for buy, if you're looking for buy, if you're looking for buy, uh, look for in engulfing. You see sale engulfing eventually on the on the uh, sale in, uh, upper side of the buy zone. If you see any any sideways market, look for any uh, buy engulfing on the lower side. Let's show me. Let's show you a perfect example. Where is US thirty? Where is it? Okay, this one. We are in one minute time frame. Though this is the sale happened from here, just look at this. What I this is the whole range, right? This is the whole range. Yeah. This is the whole range. What we have here? What we have here? This zone okay. is fully break out with this candle, and this yeah. sideway a little bit upper side. A little bit upper side of you sideway and and it is sharply moved down every single example is same here every single example look at this this is the sideway market we have and sale engulfing on here but before that you need to find out your zone so this is this is the this is the example i saw uh here this is the sideway this is the sideway look at this this is the engulfing and market just come back to upper side of your engulfing and fall any time frame is same 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 sideway so if you're looking for a buy then buy if sideway look at this do not need to show anything else what i just said is this sideway right we are in 15 minute time frame a little bit upper side you have what so you are conservative one you can do this one i mostly prefer with the gold and gbp jpy so us 30 is yeah that's great so this is how you eventually filter any more question i will go i, 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 I think I will, I will close in two to five minutes most of the people here i think therefore <laughs> i'm not sure uh, either you do not know what I said or you do not even understand what I said or or, or maybe I make something complex here. Yeah. Yes. Uh, uh, are you trading only helping orders? No, no. What I, what I just showed you in the one minute. I do combine everything. Like as I said, okay. look at this. Eventually, eventually, uh, Asana, Asana, and uh, if you mix the Asana and the engulfing, it will make you much more precise entry. Much more precise entry. As I said, if you understand Asana fresh and fresh level, look at this one. Yeah, yeah. This is the this is the level, right? Fresh. Yeah, yeah. It is miss. You know the misconcept. Yeah, yeah. So this is miss. Yeah, yeah. So in the same time you have this, right? So how many yeah, yeah. how many confirmation you are having here? One is fresh. Yeah. One is fresh. One is yeah, yeah. okay. Engulfing is uh, 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 rise. Engulfing miss and a very fresh level. These are the basic three formula of Malaysian way. Now remain is your hand how you preferably how perfectly you apply this to your chart. For that one you need multi time frame. So when you go to the multi time frame, multi time frame is giving you much more clearer view. Look, uh, if you say only if you if you trade only this one is fresh, right? On the five minute. Yeah. This one is fresh, very fresh. So let's say you do not want to enter on here. 
this is uh, like me i enter on there so it is 22 bits for me but look at this one how much it is sorry how much it is that's that's where leave enter this is the 11 bits one fresh and what engulfing right now let's say you do not also you want to wait more anything fresh you see here anything fresh delete anything fresh uh, this is fresh miss miss but this is fresh right right and yeah. and the yeah. and the fresh level you have this so now uh, look at this how much you have only eight pips so that's how i filter in multi time frame and and we have another fresh level here this is the very fresh also so it is like only uh, five pips Bro, last question, bro. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> bro, when you mark us uh, uh, Are you are you the uh, A Rohit from the group? Yeah, bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, so you should sometime you should text me, do give me some diet. I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, yeah. Okay, okay. No problem, bro, no problem. <laughs> bro, I have a question. Yeah, go ahead. When you mark us Mm-hmm. You also mark uh, when you refine it. You uh, you know that uh, uh, in a MSNR when you mark uh, SNR, you will, your last time frame for marking SNR is one hour, right? Mm. So yeah. uh, when you go, when you refine. No, no, no. For me, right now, for me, right now, I try to play with thirty minutes. That's my new girlfriend kind of. It is mini time from me mini time frame for me uh, h4 is the base h4 is the base uh, listen yeah. listen i'm going to uh, i'm going to tell you something i'm going to tell you something uh, which is learn everything whatever you see in front like the topic you are choosing whatever you see in front of you on this topic let's say only snr you find everything on the snr learn everything and once you try to apply with the chart you will only use 10 percent trust me you're not going to use 100 percent from that 10 percent you you need to add 90 percent of your own knowledge yeah. nothing nothing going to yeah. work with the textbook one few trade you will see the textbook based but most of them is based on you what you have learned what you have experienced with the chart that's how yeah. And there is there is another way with the Bollinger Band way. Uh, I I will not I will not uh, share it. I I think I am just blocking people to join the team. I will open it our next two to three week. Uh, and that's the reason also I am not posting any video because uh, most of the people is inboxing me for the mentorship. For now uh, it's not possible. That's why I am blocking also joining. So uh, once I see a few more people, I will do a session with Bollinger Band. Uh, that one is pretty solid so far. So solid so far in a base dot like you fixed as a fixed TP like 25 to uh, 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 50 60 pips TP. A two to three trade you will always have daily. Uh, if you have one trade then win. If you only follow that system, forget any more trade. As I said at the end of the day, we all need to making money. Yes, 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 PVMA and and uh that's one that's one i will i will, i think my plan is i will keep that one cheap like uh maybe 60 to 70 dollar one session and and all the topic will be covered for that session uh, not for now i i will i will open when i open my channel for many people then but those who are those who are is here for now uh, you guys will have it free <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bro. Thank you. Okay. So uh, we are going to end. We are going to uh, end. Uh, if there is no more session, uh, sorry, no more question. Uh, hope uh, we are going to end. Bro, someone asked BBMA. Uh, yeah, yeah. I said, I said yes, yes. I said that B BBMA is listen. BBMA is so complex. I have uh, uh, BBMA. I do not. I do not follow everything on the BBMA. Uh, only two or three terms I use for the from the BBMA. I only look for momentum. I only look for one uh, middle BBMA cross out. That's it. 
PVMA has like seven to eight term terminology uh, CSAK, CSAM, uh, momentum, uh, 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 blah blah blah. I do not follow everything because I, as I said at the end of the day, you have to come out come out with your own version. Okay, guys. Uh, thank you so much. You are going to end uh, today. Uh, hopefully you guys have some value otherwise i only uh, have one one person or two person three person eventually ask you question remain i don't know maybe they don't even know what i do <laughs> uh, okay have a great day guys bye 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 yeah thank you thank you thank you